Hi, this is Sagar Wagle, one of the musculoskeletal radiology fellows at Stanford University. We have a middle-aged woman with pain in base of right hand for several months. In this zoomed-in radiograph of the wrist, we can see osteoarthritis at the first carpometacarpal joint. Let's look at anatomy. The first metacarpal articulates with trapezium. The trapezium articulates with second metacarpal, trapezoid, and scaphoid. And the articulation between the scaphoid, trapezium, and trapezoid is called scaphotrapezial joint. This is the dorsal view. This is the volar view. And on the 3D image, we can see that scaphoid, trapezium, trapezoid, and scaphotrapezial joint there. One of the grading system for osteoarthritis of the first carpometacarpal joint is the eaton liter system. On stage 1, the imaging appearance is either normal or there is slight joint space widening and the joint space widening can be due to effusion, synovitis or ligamentous laxity and this grading is ideally done on the lateral view of the thumb. So this is the lateral view of the thumb and one way to tell this is the lateral view is the two sesamoids of the first metacarpal, they overlap with each other. These are the two sesamoids. In this case of a 48-year-old female with base of thumb pain, we can see that the joint space is normal. So this is stage 1. In stage 2, there's mild joint space narrowing with small osteophytes. This is not a dedicated thumb series, but we can see that there is mild joint space narrowing and there's small osteophyte so this would be eaton liter stage 2 in our 65 year old female tennis player with base of thumb pain here we have normal for comparison this patient underwent trapeziectomy and suspension plasty this is pre-op radiograph on the left and here we can see that the trapezium has been resected and in suspension plasty the abductor pollicis longus is resected and it's used to create a suspension to prevent the first metacarpal bone from siding down. And in this stress view, we can look at the left hand and the operated right hand, and we can see the trapezium on the right side is absent. We have a case of a 70-year-old female with base of thumb pain. Here we see severe joint space narrowing. So this is stage 3 osteoarthritis, and we have normal on the right for comparison. In stage 4, in addition to the first carpometacarpal joint arthritis, there is also arthritis of the scaphotrapezial joint. And this is the scaphotrapezial joint one more time. Here we have a 63-year-old female with base of thumb pain. And we can see the first carpometacarpal joint osteoarthritis, but also in the scaphotrapezial joint here. And in the stress view, we can see the arthritis of the scaphotrapezial joint and the first carpometacarpal joint on both sides, the first carpometacarpal joint and the scaphotrapezial joint. So this is stage 4 osteoarthritis. Let's go back to our original patient. Here we see mild joint space narrowing and osteophyte. So we'll call this stage 2 of osteoarthritis. Thank you for watching the video.